Goldie, Goldie. Her name is Goldie. Goldie, oh you are being playing. I'm a diva. Oh, I got class. You play your hate me, but you know, but you know we're not the same. I'm in my lane. Hello, my name is Goldie Harvey. Um, a pop artist um, based in Lagos. <laughs> Goldie. Nigerians would describe her as Nigerians Lady Gaga. Why well, I hate such descriptions, Nigerians this Nigerians that she's golden, not Lady Gaga. At least she has not come to on stage in an eggplant yet. <laughs> um, I'm the first one of my parents. I'm from Ikiti State, Ikoli in Ikiti State. Um, I have five siblings, three brothers and two sisters. I grew up in Anthony village of Lagos State. That's where we grew up. Uh, my school was in was Green Springs, not far from my house, not far from where we used to stay. Green Springs was so school. That was where I had my primary school education, and then from there I went to St John's College, and uh, I have a degree in business management from the University of Sunderland. Goldie is gold in so many different ways. She's filled with uh, so much life. Um, she's uh, she's always smiling, leaves in perfection, and. Um, I like, I like the fact that she always wants to be the best at what she can be. First of all, I come from a very, very religious background. Um, <laughs> I was not allowed any social friends apart from church. And um, church was like, we went to church like three days a week, like Mondays, Wednesdays, and Sundays. And then once every month, last Friday of the month, the next video. So my mom was in the choir, a uh, senior church choir. So, you know, when I became old enough, I, you know, I was, there was no other option. I had to be in the junior church choir and you know I've always been into the theatres, the stage plays in the church, everything that had to do with the arts in the church from a very young age because my, both my parents were very active members of the church and as a firstborn I was expected to be into all that. The only thing I'm going to tell you about Goldie, there are so many things people don't know about Goldie. Yeah, I see her, see her as the most hardworking female artist in Nigeria. And, uh, a very serious person when it comes to working. It doesn't, you know, it doesn't joke when she's working. Um, she's a very friendly person. A lot of people don't even know. She is a very playful person. I remember from a very young age, I used to sing in corridors. My 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 songs <laughs> were very songs that we listened to growing up. My mom listened to a lot of Abba, a lot of Tracy Chapman, um, Dolly Parton. My dad listened to Kenny Rogers, and I would I would I remember vividly like here now. Like standing in front of fans, big standing fans, and singing and hearing my voice. So, so I was always singing every everywhere. So I knew that I loved music, and I remember like the first Christmas present I, present I had, you know, that my uncle bought for me headphones, and I would listen to, you know, <laughs> songs all the time, Tony Braxton, then and stuff like that. Um, when I was in the UK, myself and my friends, we formed, we had like. A sort of informal pop group where we perform for friends and family, you know, for course mates, for lecturers in school, and we, we used to do that all the time. Actually, uh, if I if I have to say two things about Goldie, I'll say one, she's a born artist, and secondly, she's uh, she's Goldie. When I got back to Nigeria, when I got back to Nigeria, um, I met with um, a producer, a producer for. Um, the radio program and he was also into producing music and I we got talking and I told him about what I'd done in the UK and stuff like that with my my informal pop pop group and he we went to the studio and we recorded a couple of tracks and from there I met someone who introduced me to OJB and we ended up recording the track Komole and shooting the video. Um, that video was released April 2007. It was my first video <laughs> and it was OJB Komole. Goldie is a female artist like you should know. Molly Bapolo Jawo Jawo. I mean Goldie's songs just like they are out of this world basically but it's what happens and that's one good thing about an artist you should be able to pinpoint you know those happenings you know that 
are obvious but are not really, really obvious. You know, she sings about those obvious things that are not obvious. I shot another video, Spain Me, and that one was really, really highly. In fact, yeah, both videos were nominated for awards then for the Big Ticket, like Best World Videos in that 2007, 2008. Spain Me got to number three on the MTV base chart. I think and that was I was the first female to, to ever get and I was relatively new in the in the country in the industry so that was like a big achievement for me there. I go, worry them. If I stand I go, worry them. If I move I go, worry them. Move your body to the south. Um I've also had the pleasure to work with Goldie. I mean, we did Get Loose together uh, on her album. And also, we got a chance to do another record on my album called Kumo Kumo Kumo. Afterwards, I decided that, look, afterwards I said I wanted to like, you know, get signed to a proper, you know, record company. And I started looking around and I ended up with sticks in the staples of Kenny's music um, record label. And, you know, <laughs> and afterwards, um, Mr. Kenny Ogunle, the CEO, advised me that I should do, I should collaborate with LD because of my sound and because um, I come from a very, very pop background. And I could tell that LD, as a producer, I came from a very pop, you know, background as well. So we ended up collaborating and we recorded a single, you know it. Not by me, but the way everybody like jumped on the you know it bandwagon once it came out was really awesome, you know. And everybody was just like really, really going gaga for the song, and you know it was <laughs> it was really awesome. Um, got to number one on all major countdowns, radio and TV countdowns. The video was shot by uh, Clarence Peters, and you know um, the song was just really big. Nobody could understand how the song came to be so big and it won me several awards, it won best cinematography, it won best new video, the sound and music video award, um, it won uh, video for best costume as well and it also gathered me like awards outside outside Lagos to show awards, achievements and awards and you know as best female performing artist of the year and you know such accolades you know humble you and make you make you want to work harder as a person. Afterwards, after that, after all that, we released the album, an album of title called 15 track album, um, featuring J1, Minji, um, Femi, Essence, Vakeke himself wrapped on one of the tracks. Um, majority of the tracks were produced by Master Craft. Yeah, it's like, it was actually fun having to work with her on this particular project. Uh, you know, she, she's this kind of person that, that has a very high taste for quality music. She has a high taste for quality music and then you know over time it has, it has been achieved and it's cool. I in, I actually enjoyed myself working with her in the studio. Yeah. So far the album, you know, we released another single which is Jao Jao featuring J1 and we shot a video for it and the the hype surrounding that as well has even in in a way you know, so past that of you know it because now when I enter it, because everybody's always singing after me, ciao, ciao, lomo, and it's just so, so crazy. So I mean, it's been, it's been a whirlwind ride. So. You look at me so classy, so fine. You wanna touch that? Booty best be spending over a time, yeah Don't want too much, just to watch a Rolex watch My shoes must be designer, Fendi or even Prada My bag will be a mansion, boy on the island Vacation trips, first class, American Express, credit cards Range Rover, Eco Moto, no Arcada by my motto Want to be my wife, cheap or don't wanna be your wife A 
I'm an avid supporter of um, human rights, the rights of all human beings to express themselves and achieve whatever success that they they feel it is necessary to achieve for themselves. I'm an avid supporter of the women rights as well. As a result, I recorded a documentary titled Evolution, and that led me to the state of <coughs> Project Alert, um, which is a non-government, non-profit organization um, that that advocates no tolerance to all forms of violence against women. Um, in my documentary, I spoke to spoke with the um, women that had been abused, you know, young girls who had been abused, women who, you know, I spoke to a, para, a woman that a para Paralympian who had minimal use of her legs, but went outside the country and won gold medals for like, you know, and stuff in sports, and it was a very very touching story. It shows that anybody can achieve anything if someone that doesn't have, couldn't walk, could go outside the country and achieve so much. I spoke to Deputy Governor uh, Sira Shosa, who, you know, from her background, where she is today, nobody would have ever believed that she could be where she was. And this was just, you know, to prove to women everywhere that they can achieve anything they want to achieve, um, regardless of their social status, how poor, how wealthy they were growing up, or the condition of their physical, you know, bodies. You know. I believe that we are our mind, not our body or our situation. Um, she's fun. She likes to have fun. I get tired quickly. She wears me out. <laughs> you know, but it's all good. You know, sometimes, you know, you just have to just like mix it all up, mix it all up. What else can I say about Goldie? Goldie has repertoire, you know, for an artist. I always tell people, when you go on stage, what do you have to offer? Goldie has repertoire. You go to Spain Me, you go to Kumole. Uh, you know, <laughs> so the air smells different right now. I have um, a new single off the album that I'm working on. We're going to be shooting the video very, very soon. Um, the song is a song that everybody loves, <laughs> loves a lot. It's titled Don't Touch, Don't Touch and um, it's <laughs> it's me alone on the track. We had like a version, an original version and then we had like a remix version as well um, that is also going to be promoted as well and um, everybody's looking forward to seeing the video because they can't wait to see what I'm going to do next. We're also planning on going on a boat tour around the country. We're planning on visiting 11 states around the country and also Kenny's Music National Tour and an international tour in the US of A. So that's what, that's what everybody should be looking forward to. And I just like to this opportunity to say I love you all, um, all my fans, everybody that supports me, everybody that votes for me anytime I need, comes up with nominations, award nominations. I love you all, I appreciate you all. I wouldn't be where I am today without you all, without your love and support. And I will keep working hard and I will let you down. We'll keep putting out good music, baby. Thank you. <laughs> uh, I need to.
lips first class American Express Credit cards Range Rover Echo Moto No offer that by my motto Want to be my wife Cheap but don't wanna be your wife And then you jam wo Jam wo jam wo no more Spend the money And then you jam wo Jam wo jam wo no more And then you jam wo Jam wo jam wo no more Spend the money And then you jam wo Jam wo jam wo no more Come and go Someone from far away Discourage myself from being Cali the way